MLB The Show in this presentation of Minor League Baseball. Today we've got a good matchup ahead between the Salt Lake Bees and the Sugarland Skeeters. Now, ladies and gentlemen, welcome. It's baseball on the show, Sugarland and it's coming up Skeeter. next. Now at the plate, here is Dexter Fowler. He will lead this one off today. The 1-1 one, one is taken for ball two. two and one. And a check swing here as he couldn't help two, himself, two. and it's ruled strike two. The 2-2 two, two is swung on and missed strike three. Stepping up is Joe Adele. The left one out, nobody seven. on. Joe Adele. Drives it out to deep right center field. Dawson will range to his left and put it away. Two down. Here's the center fielder, Mike Trout. And if you remember, he took home a silver slugger award for AL outfielders a year ago. Now the 2-1. Strike two, swinging. You can really tell they're trying to keep the ball in on this big slugger right here. Is that an effort to keep him from getting... Thought we'll have to press pause. Is that strike three to retire the side? So stepping in is Ross Adolph. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Swing and a ground ball to third. And that's through for a hit. Batting second. The left field. Michael. Into the Brantley. box. Michael Brantley. Line towards center field. Trout is there and he has it for the first out. Next to hit is Ronnie Dawson. First swings for him in this one with a runner still at first and one gone. Now a throw over. And he'll get back in safely. Adolph leads off first with one away. Runners off for second. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Trout has a read on it. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. Next up, Taylor Jones who takes course. his first cuts in this the one with a man at first and two Taylor. away. Jones. He's set, and the 2 1 pitch. A bouncer to the left side. Over to first, and that retires the side. Second inning set to go, and that'll bring up Anthony Rendon. And he takes one off the inside corner for ball two. This right-handed pitcher, his bread and butter is that two-seamer, and he loves to throw it inside. Oh. Can't find the zone there, and it's three and one. High in the air down the right field line. Adolph is over a few steps toward the line, and he has it for the first down. Stepping in next, Matt Thais. No score here as we play inning number two. It's a swing and a high pop up. Stubbs is there. And he makes the catch for the second out. Digging in will be Scott Shepler. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. The 2 1. High in the air out to center field. Dawson finds some space out there for the catch to retire the side.
Now to the plate, number 13. He'll get his first shot with the bat here. Called strike that time, and it's even at two and two. What a well-executed fastball right there. Down and away. If you're going to do any damage with that pitch, you have to think up the middle the other way, and you have to be diving and leaning out over that thing. Outside in a full count, three and two. Well, you don't see it all that often, but this might be a good time for a 3-2 change. If he can locate it, it's nearly impossible oh. to hit. Throw to first is in time for the first down. So now to the plate, Jordan Brewer. The designated hitter, Jordan Brewer. A ball and two strikes. One ball, two strikes. He's going to have to set his sights a little lower right there. That pitch was able to get by him. His swing was just a little under that one. Reined in. Throw gets him. He's two down. down. Digging in next, Freyuti Snova try to make something happen with two gone in the bottom of the second. Here now the 2-2. He is swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. And next up will be Franklin Barreto. From the windup, the 1-1 one, one pitch. Swing and a flare down the line. Here comes the right fielder. Base hit, and they're into the hit column. Batting it. The second base. Mitch. Yeah. At the plate, Mitch Nane. That's and that misses two and one. We got two the balls, offense better get track. it going right here, because they certainly can tell from their dugout this guy is carrying himself with a presence out on the mound. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Looking up is the center fielder. And that one is gone! So now to the plate, Chad Waller. And this is taken for a called strike. Oh, that's a tough call. Now one and two. Swung on in the dirt for the third strike. Stubbs has it, and he makes He's the out. throw to first. Wallach is retired, and there's one away. One out, base is now empty, back. and that'll bring I'm in like the switch you. hitting outfielder Dexter, Dexter. Fowler. Oh. Now the 2 1 pitch. And right into the shift. And he'll step oh. on first himself for the out. Stepping in once again is Joe Adele. Flew out in his only at bat so far. The 1 1 home. Swing and a miss as the slider sets him down for the final out of the inning. for the last half of the inning and standing in as the switch hitting second baseman Robo Garcia. Hey Matty they need to get some offense going in this one getting a run back in this inning give them a little bit of confidence that they can keep up in this game. Here comes the one two and he fouls this one off. Again a one two high and deep down the left field line. But this is going to wind up a foul ball. He'll try again, one, two. And that's a swinging strike three in the dirt. And the throw is there to record the first down. Now to the plate, here is Garrett Stubbs. The catcher. Garrett Full count here. Here comes the pitch. He pulls this one high and deep to right center field. And, oh, he missed a home run by a matter of feet. It's off the wall. And he is in at second base with a one-out double. The right fielder, number two, Rock Angel. Pickoff move to second. He's and safe. he'll dive back in safely. In now, Ross Adolph. Get back toward the mound. 
And that's through into center field. Base hit. The throw home. And he will get in there with their first run. It's a two to one game now. Number 23. Michael to the plate now. Michael Brantley. Fastball is outside and it's full now. Three and two. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Trout is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. Next up is Ronnie Dawson. He flew out in his last AB. Ronnie Dawson. Two and two. Hey, usually the second time through the order, you start seeing an incorporation of some more off-speed stuff. But this guy's locating and feeling really good about his fastball. A swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will do it. And that'll bring Mike Trout to the dish, looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at-bat. Looking to punch him out again, the pitch. Shot to third and handled for the first out. In now is Anthony Rendon. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Hammered the other way to deep right field. Adolph is back to the warning track and he's able to put it away for the second out. The first base now with the plate is Matt Sice. Matt. He popped out in his no. first trip. Yeah, Matt Ian, looked like he got fooled a little bit. A little bit out front, ended up popping out. Hey. Expect him to be a little bit more leery of the breaking pitch this A.B. Ready on one and two. Swing and a miss. Blew the fastball right by him, and the inning is over. Bottom of the inning now, and here comes the first baseman, Taylor Jones. Three and one, here it is. And ball that misses four, for Anthony ball four. four. It's a leadoff walk that starts the bottom of the fourth. Now, now into the box, number 13. Oh for one for him here in this one. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. Team's been struggling on offense. Let your D work for you right here. Pound the zone. And ooh, might have thought it was high, but it's a strike three and two now. Working for the punch out and the offering. And he wasn't going to hit that one with an or the strikeout, and there's one gone. Fourth inning of a two to one ball game. Brewer. High in the air down the right field line. Fowler on the run. And this will wind up a foul ball. Here comes the one two. It's a fastball that misses. We just saw a fastball right there. I would not be shocked if he tries to get this guy to go fishing right here and drops a little off speed pitch in the dirt. Here's a blooper out toward left center. Moretto takes charge out there and he stays with it for the second out. And now in the box, Freyudis Nova struck out in his last trip to the plate. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one. And we'll see if he tries to cheat to something this AB. Ball taken there. Two and one now. Fastball just inside. And this pitch misses for ball four. So that's going to move a runner into scoring position Number now with two Number away. Three. Second baseman. Digging in, the switch hitter, Robo Garcia. A base knock to the outfield could score the tying run from second. Good fastball down around the knees there, taken for a strike. The problem for the batter now is he's gotten so inside conscious after those first two pitches, anything on the outer half of the plate is going to look a foot outside. One-two pitch. 
ball. That's now two and two. This is the pitch where you want to attack the zone. If you go three and two, then you put the runners in motion. Here's the two and two. Jones over at second. Nova at first, two out in the inning. Waved at and missed for the third out. Not much of a chance at hitting that one, and the inning is over. All ready to go in the top of the fifth, and that'll bring up the big left handed bat of Scott Shevler. Now the one and one pitch. Is swung on and missed for strike number two. That was a great hack right there. Timing was on point. Just sometimes you have bad bat barrel accuracy. Weak grounder back to the mound. And the fifth oh. inning will start with a ground out, one away. No one on with one down. And the exciting middle infielder Franklin Barreto bats next. Ball and two strikes now. Lucky he got a piece right there. He was definitely late on that pitch after seeing a previous off speed pitch. He's got it. Throw on the first, and Verlander's got it going here. Two away. Ready to take his hacks again. Mitch Nain blasted a two run homer in his last at bat. He turned around that fastball and drove it out of the park in his previous at bat. So there's got to be a good chance they mix it up right here on him and try and go off speed. Wanted to get the front door curveball on the inside corner there, but it backed up a little and stayed off the corner. Three and one to him now. Swung on and missed that strike two. Fifth inning, two to one our score. Strike three on a pitch in the dirt. And He's that out. ends the inning. Ladies Junior Guerra, a right hander standing please. six foot even, will take now over the pitching duties here. Number 41. So now here is Garrett Stubbs. He doubled his last time up. Well, he got a good pitch to hit last time up. Looked for it up in the zone and didn't miss it. Those are the pitches you only get maybe once an A-B, maybe once a game, ball, maybe once strikes. a week. Yep. So he certainly capitalized on it last time. Nope. Pitch taken several inches below the zone, in fact. Fastball is right by him as he swings and misses for the first out of the inning. The right now back to the Number top two. of the lineup. Stepping in, oh. Ross Adolph. Two hits and two trips for him thus far. Ready with the one and one. Uh, not fooled there as this ball's hammered out to deep right field. And that'll get down out there for extra bases. And he is in the second base with a double. His third hit this afternoon. Now back. No left field. Brantley. Stepping in now, Michael Brantley. Now a ball lined hard toward right center. And this will hop over the wall, but the run will score. At the plate now, Ronnie Dawson. And he struck him out, so he's down on strikes for the second time this afternoon. Now bat. So the First next to bat will be Taylor, Taylor Jones. Runner in scoring position Yay. with two gone. Here's the 1-1. One, one. Back up the oh no, that got him. Fortunately, he's able to stick with it and get the out at first, and that'll put an end to the inning. So now into the box is Chad Waller. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Into the corner and slicing foul. The 1 2. And a check swing here, but the bat clearly breaks the plane as he's set down for the first out. Now that 
Here's Dexter, Dexter Fowler now. Dexter. He's hitless in his two at bats so far. Now the 2 1. High in the air down the right field line. Adolf is in his tracks now. And that's out number two. So Joe Adele bats now. 0 for 2 here to start the afternoon. Bases are empty here with two men out. Softly hit toward the hole. He's got to hurry. Throw to first with time to spare, and the side is retired. Now at the plate, number 13. He's 0 for 2 with a strikeout in this one. Just behind the fastball there, two strikes now. Hey, no shame in that. Your eyes light up when that heater comes above the belt. That's so tough to lay off of. Just hung in there on that one. And this is pop foul, but perhaps playable behind first. And there's out number one. Next will be the designated now, hitter, the Jordan designated Brewer. Hitter. It's been an 0 for 2 yeah. effort for him to this point. Brewer. One and two. One ball, two strikes. And they'll try to get two him ball, fishing there, but he strikes. won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at two and two. The pitch. Hit out towards second. He gets dirty, but he can't get there, and it's into center field. The batter, number one. Good stop. At the plate for Yudis Nova. And he yep, can't catch the out. corner here, so he's behind three and one. No reason to sit on anything other than the hard stuff in a location you like and drive it right now. Hit the other way out toward right field. There to take it as Fowler as that becomes out number two. Next, it'll be Robo Garcia. He struck out twice thus far, so we'll see if he can fare any better here. The set and the 1 1 pitch. And they pitch out here, but nothing's going on. Ready to deal. Here's the 2 1. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Back goes Fowler, but he can't get to this one. It's off the wall. And the run will score all the way from first. It's a 3 to 2 ball game. Now that the catcher. Into the box now. Garrett Stubbs. Oh. One and two now as that one's fouled off. Good take that time on a low breaking ball. Two and two now. Good job to lay off that one-two breaking ball. Put himself right back in this at bat. Trying to Go nibble down. here, and he Three misses and to run it full now. Three and two. For the guy in the mound, this is one of those innings where nothing comes easy. He's thrown a bunch of pitches, and this A.B. hasn't been any different. Definitely laboring at the moment. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as this side is retired. And he'll get us started in what's officially the back third of this one. And he lays oh. off ball four. So now the potential tying run here is aboard late in the game. Pedro Baez takes the ball here as he'll enter with the runner at first and nobody out. And digging in next will be Anthony Rendon. Career numbers against Baez. He's one for four. Change up that time. A swing, and this one's driven out to deep left center field. This ball has a chance, and it is over the wall. A home run. In now, Matt Sykes. 
hit in the air out to left field. Under it now is Brantley, and he has it for the first out. Next to stand in now, is Scott Shepler. He was hitting. retired via the ground Scott. ball last time up. Shepler. Here now the 2-2. Now a swinging bunt. Fouled off. Way inside with that one, a pretty easy take there. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters, so you can't afford to be giving out free passes this late. He's set. Here's the three and two. And he finally wins the battle as this is swung on and missed for the second out. Now batting. Next to hit, Franklin Barreto. He Franklin bounced out last Barreto. time up. Three and one, here it is. Comes with the fastball, but it's outside for ball four. Up next, Mitch Nay comes in one for two with that home run he hit earlier. Down the third baseline, but this will be a foul ball as that evens things at two and two. Strike three called as he says, you got to be kidding me with the side retired. James Hoyt gets the call from the pen to take the ball for the home seventh. Number 50, James Last half of the seventh here, and standing in the outfielder, Ross Adolph. The 1 1 pitch. Oh, that took good. Looks like he's pitching pretty cautiously right here, but that happens when a guy's three for three on the day. Usually he's a guy you challenge a little bit more, but no, I guess he's earned some respect in this one. Three and one to him now. He lays That's off, ball four. So now the potential tying run here is aboard late in the game. And now here is Michael Brantley in his career against this pitcher. He's one for two. Quick check on that tying run at first. Pitch out. Nothing doing. Now the 2-1 pitch. Whoa, this situation right here reminds me of sitting on the bench talking to John Smoltz, Hall of Famer. He would always say, even though the situation looked bad, a pitcher is one pitch away from getting himself out of a tough jam. Now the 3-2 and two pitch. And he missed with it. Ball four. So that means now the potential tying run will move into scoring position at second. Possibly tying and go-ahead runs on base. Nobody out. And the low 80s slider is in there, and he's in control one and two. Here's a fastball in on the fist, and that'll even things up at two and two. Number three hole hitter up right now. Cleanup guy on deck. Two ball, two strike count. I think pitcher wants to make something happen right here. Count still full, three and two. Another full count pitch home. Possible tying and go ahead runs on base. Nobody out. And he struck out again. That's the third time he's gone down on strikes in this one. Felix Pena takes the call from the pen as he'll try to get the final two outs of this seventh frame. Taylor Jones will be his first assignment here as he'll face him with runners at first and second and one gone. Down low, two balls and a strike. Has to be a challenge pitch coming up here. He probably doesn't want to flirt with loading the bases. Fouled away. One out with the possible tying and go-ahead runs on base here. 
And it's fouled away. The 2 2 one more time. Is crushed to straightaway center. No doubt about this one. That ball is gone. So now to the plate, number 13. Rendon down to third. Throw on to first, oh. two gone. Striding now forward back. now the is the D.H., Jordan Brewer. He reached on a single last time and later wound up scoring. High and deep to right center. Back goes Trout to the track. He can't get there in time, and now it hops over the wall for a ground rule double. Stepping in now for Yudis Nola. Swinging a soft liner, and that's through into center field. Base hit. Back on another here as the runner scores from second. That makes it 7-4. Luke Bard takes over here Number with the runner three. at first second and two gone man. in the inning. Standing in now, Robo Garcia. I got three and two. One that misses inside and the counts run full now. Three and two. Hit out towards second. Uh, it's flagged down deep in the hole. Throw on to first will finally retire him as the inning will draw to a close. Hinoli Paredes has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Number 48. Ready to begin the eighth, and next to hit is the catcher, Chad Waller. The 2-2. It's the top of the zone. He struck him out looking. Now it'll be Dexter Fowler. Flew out last time up. Dexter. The 1-1. Ground ball sent back up the middle, and that is through into center field for a one-out single. Into the box, Joe Adele. Crowd gets up for the 3 2, and he fouls this one off. Once again, a 3 2. Fastball, strike three called as he couldn't pull the trigger, and there are two away. At the plate now is Mike Trout. He's 0 for 2 thus far in this one. A 1 1 home. Swing and a ball lifted in the air toward the line in right. Adolph is there, makes the catch, and the side is retired. Into the box, Garrett Stubbs. No career numbers to talk about for this matchup. Hey. And he comes back with a fastball, one and two now. Bouncer up the middle. Barreto's got it. And there's one down now. So the batting order turns over now and set to go. Ross Adolph trying to keep it going. A perfect three for three thus far. Here now the 2-2. Two -two. We got a full count. And a fastball blew it right by him, and there are two down. Here's Michael Brantley. Two out, nobody on. Michael Brantley. Weak roller right side. And eight innings have come and gone now as the inning is over. Andre Scrub comes on from the pen, hoping to finish this one off here in the top of the ninth. Number 70. 
So kicking off the top of the ninth is Anthony Rendon. As they'll look to spark the offense and even things up. They look like they're up against it here. Down three on the road trying to come back against the closer. And this pitch misses here. It's ball four. And they've got a leadoff base runner aboard to start the ninth. The first base. Rendon aboard here at first with nobody out. A breaking ball swung on and missed, and he set down for the second time this afternoon. The batter, so a runner at first now with one away, and that'll bring up the big left-handed bat of Scott Shebler. Fought off at the plate as it's chopped foul. Pulled toward right center field. Right fielder is on the run. But it's over his head, and it hops the wall for a ground rule double. At the plate, Franklin Barreto. Helping him out here as he swings and misses the ball behind the ball in two strikes. Oh, don't know how you lay off that one, but he did, and it's two and two. Hey, this isn't going to be an easy save. These guys are making it work for this one. Fouled off. Front there as this one's pulled off to the left side. Eighth pitch of the at bat coming up. Fouled away. The two two one more time. Well, I think that pitch is the result of a lot of foul balls. He might have tried to do a little bit too much with it, trying to get him to swing through it, but it just ended up taking off on him. Good swing just a little early, and they'll see another payoff pitch. Open to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Softly hit to short. Scooped up. And indeed, he'll take only the out at first as the run comes in to score. Now to bat, Mitch Ney. He comes to the plate as the last chance for his side. Two out here in the ninth. And he lays off for a ball. Two and one. And this is swung on and missed. So with that, they find themselves down to their final strike here this afternoon. There's ball three on a breaking ball that misses away. Chad Wallet would be next. Ah, and he strikes him out to end it here as they were able to get the possible tying run to the plate but could not cash in. Yeah, he does surrender one run. So it wasn't a flawless performance. But in this game, you don't have to be perfect. You just have to be good enough to win. He was. Seven to five how today's comes to an end. The Skeeters put up four runs in the seventh to carry them to victory. Pedro Baez is the winning pitcher of record. So that'll just about do it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. For more, don't forget to check out theshow.com. our final line score. First for the victorious Peters, seven runs on ten hits. No errors. They left seven men on base. For the B.